What up, guys? It's your girl, Manit Meeks, and I am back with the final episode of Generation Kill. It has been a ride. As a matter of fact, I haven't watched it in a hot second, simply because I've been busy. But here we are, the final episode. So if you're enjoying this uh, reaction series or anything else I got on my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I'm here. You're here. Let's be here together. <sighs> I think last time they were helping um, the people... They weren't crossing. Where, what were they doing? They were like walking from to the nearest town and they needed passage. So they were escorting them all the way through and, and they were just being hit with what's going on. How all these people walking across that they were hungry, they were tired and they were walking hundreds of miles just to get to the next safe city. And some of the kids were going to make it. And so it was just them experiencing that part. That's all I remember from that episode. So on that note, I'm going to go ahead and jump into the final episode, Bomb in the Garden of that's a lot of city. That is a lot of city. Not careful. We get lost in this here. Huh? Need to rename that bitch. What is he singing? Roger that, man. <laughs> Lost your mic and five mics. Mount up! We're on the road, boys! Is it New York, New York? No. Dude, check it out. I wrote USA with my pit. Okay. Trailers for sailor and room to land fifty cents. No phone, no food, no pets. I ain't got no cigarettes. I'm on a two hours of ocean room by the eight by twelve for this room. Give me Cocker. He is no longer on this team. Over. Say again. Be advised. The team leader's been fired. Over. Can't race Cocker? He's not riding with 3-2. Are you guys seeing King of the Road without me? Yep. <laughs> you fucking execute people for shit like this in California. ATLs! Looks like we're saving the vehicles outside! So they're just holed up in this city. Gunny! What's the drill here? We've been digging holes every night. Combat's over, Rude. Besides, you can't dig through concrete. Dirty. What the fuck's going on? Cuck and Redmond, you gotta hear from them. They're back with Motor T, Colbert. Motor T? Look at his little baby Brad, face, he mad. Oh, Brad. How'd you like my new MOS? I'm a fucking bug. At least we got tunes. Gangster back here with the hoes, dude. What's going on? He ain't team leader no more. Because of that EPW takedown? Going with Captain America was trying to get us to help Ben at the Haji. Huh? He tries to stick the dude, we stop him, or we get suspended. Then reservists reported our unit. That's a report saying we're all involved. We were trying to stop the captain. Now I'm a war criminal. The Are you serious? Godfather's on him personally. Why is the captain still commanding the platoon? They relieved him for about 20 minutes. They reinstated him. Seems like officers don't like to suspend other officers. Every one of us, we get paid to brutalize people. But our captain, he's brutal to the wrong people. Eric, I'm not going to stand for this. Are you shitting me? I request masks. You know where to find us. It's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> Brad. You heard, didn't you? You better get five Man, feet from this dude. This. Fuck out of here. Full bird colonel at Sencom. Fuck out of here. Him. I'm hiring a lawyer. For all of us. For all of you. The important thing, Brad, is that Eric and Redmond hang together. We don't want them talking on their own. Eric looks up to you. Let him know I gotta take the lead. Nah, bruh. Sir, at the risk of speaking out of turn, it seems to me those men might not share the same interests as you. Bitch. They're suspended. And you're not mm -hmm. beyond my control. Bitch. Ain't nobody got time for that you know, shit. Brad, Move out of his face before he fucks back. your ass in. They said that we would be Move. held accountable to facts, not as Move. they are in hindsight, but as they appeared to us at the time. Move. They told us that going in. Move. And now they're hanging us out to dry. Us. A fucking car bomb at the main gate. Other fuckers from 1-5 are lighting up the street like it's cool. 
Should we go help him out? No. Full bird uncle at Senka. I'm sure he's mentioned it to you. There's nothing to be done, Brad. Just suck it up and smile. Where are you going? Probably would have liked democracy. Is that all you got? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Got a letter from my wife here. What's wrong with that? It came from a lawyer. Damn, dog. That's cold. <laughs> That's ridiculous still. She, uh, wants to take my kids with her back to Reno. She says she, she's going to join the Marines so we can be closer. She already signed the papers. The fuck? No, bitch. Yeah, maybe Flash and Cobra's right up a fucking lawyer's ass, too. You know? See? This is why you don't do that to people. That is some fuck shit. You don't do that to people. If morale gets really bad, Mike. Let me know. I'll stir him up good with the grooming standard. I'll let you know. Still weird. It's <laughs> still weird. At least now I know there's a reason behind it, but it's still weird. This is what we're talking about, sir. Actually, sir, it's the only place in the compound not covered by this three meter wall. It's this chain link fence. Get down. Get down. Sniper, he's in front of us. How can you tell? You can only hear that clearly when he's directly in front of the rifle barrel. That zip means it's passing a few meters from our ears. One at a time. Sir! All right, Poco. Bounding! Set! Reporter, you ready? Yes! Go! <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, I understand it. But he, <laughs> he looks a fucking mess. What the fuck? <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> He's too busy laughing at him. All up, sir. Report it. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Serpentine shell. Serpentine. <laughs> yeah, the movie. Kill us. Peter Falk tells Alan Arkin, always run in a serpentine fashion. I was running evasively. Next time we come under fire, run in a straight line, you'll live longer. And have a full happy life of betraying us and others with your vena lies. <laughs> this place is crawl of a fucking Oh lies. my gosh. <laughs> Looks like my fucking high school, man. That was pretty it. fucking funny. We're sending out one patrol a day. <sighs> yeah. This is Charlie today. Us Were those made for climbing? That is dangerous. And he's too close to him. He needs to scooch over to the the left. I don't like it. That is the most. That sounds really close. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Nice. I'm mad he took the whole painting. Where is you gonna put that? Look how they're just slow walking in front of these giant ass trucks. I'm 
America good. Sit down, no good. You want anything, Brian? No good. No good. Okay. We have nothing to do but talk. Okay. Play dominoes, smoke. Saddam was an asshole. The men are all sitting around talking shit. The women are all working. Bro, if we fight the women instead of the men, we get our asses kicked. Men act like they actually want us here. Let me see under glasses. Beautiful eyes. Thank you. You like boys or girls? Yeah. Girls, dog. <laughs> girls. Ooh. Go with my friend. Um. Like. Nah, bro. Hey, Walt. I think we got a light one here. The ability of hostile forces in Baghdad to successfully and continually engage our forces will be complicated by the local Shias' intolerance for regime paramilitary forces hiding out in their neighborhoods. You're saying we're gonna stand down and let one side kill the other. Italian says we don't go out at night, it's too dangerous. Godfather says the Shias will be doing our dirty work for us. If we go out after dark, the Shias might engage us. Oh, um, and tomorrow night, we're billeted to the north of the city in a hospital complex. But Captain, this neighborhood we were at today, it needed That's a... not our mission. I know he is sick of this shit. Alaikum assalam. The Americans are coming to help you. They are coming to help you. They are coming to help you. This just sucks. Because they're doing all this and they're not doing anything. We don't need anything. The water and the water are coming to George Bush. Like what's the point of gathering all this if you're not going to do anything? We don't need anything to George Bush. You've taken the country apart, you're not putting it back together. The violence that goes mm -hmm. on at night, letting vigilantes and thieves out, will not correct the problems of Saddam's rule. Sonny, huh? rehydration pack and water, all right? You got it. Hydration pack. I want to see water. No. That's what they're telling us in the briefings. This is a 100% Shia neighborhood. They asked me if it was possible, could we stay the night? I had to tell them no, we had orders. They asked for water, I told them we'd come back another day. But guess what? I'm not coming back. I just got word that we're gonna rebuild it again. They say they have headaches, they cannot sleep, they want Valium. No. I'm not gonna give them Valium, I'm not gonna give them anything for cutting in front of the kids. ابقوا بالصلاة انتظروا دوركم اولا ان السوار ارجعوا I'm mad at this rolled up Sir, we're about to be overrun I can see that Alright, we're gonna egress as soon as possible This is a disaster. Uh, wait here. Infidel. I'm mean, just looking at him. Well, he says he welcomes the Americans as long as they don't expose the Iraqi people to any corrupting influences. I told him we'd bring water down to distribute from the mosque. Also, I asked him for help with the crowd so that they don't go crazy. He says that uh, the Americans should hit them if they come too close. <laughs> he says these people are used to being pushed around. <laughs> 